This is the Tech Phantom with another video in my series where I show you how to take on every single boss in Dark Souls with the washing pole. Today we are taking on Crossbreed Priscilla, who is an optional boss in the painted world of Ariana's. You need to be careful at the beginning of the boss fight because Priscilla will be invisible. And she does have a sight that does a lot of bleed damage. You need to look at the footprints on the snowfield, anticipate where she is going to be, and you need to take, uh, you need to do uh, attacks on her and try to cause some damage. She has a sight that does a lot of bleed damage, so be careful. Make sure that you have good armor and a good shield. Once you have done enough damage to her, she will become visible and at that point the boss fight is pretty easy. She is a big target, her attacks are easy to dodge, and uh, she doesn't have, she is not very mobile. I am trying to get to her back here because I am trying to slice off her tail. She does drop a unique weapon. Now, at the end of the boss fight, you will have the option to pick up the Xanta set. This is the best light armor in the game. Assuming that you have killed the invading Xanta's King Jeremiah in human form. And you can pick that up on your way out of the level on a corpse. As far as my equipment, uh, which you will see shortly here, I have the black iron set. I have the lightning washing pole plus five. And I am level 76. So, that was the crossbreed Priscilla boss fight in Dark Souls with the washing pole. I hope you enjoyed this video and others in my series.